Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TrophyNut and welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Last time we were looking for a way into the Cathedral of the Deep with uh, varying results. We can go across the roof! Oh, and uh, at the end of the last episode, we um, saw something moving back there. It seems to have disappeared right now. Uh, but I still hear a lot of growling. So uh, let's dramatically enter this place. Because it seems to be very big. There's a blob over there. Oh... Gold. That's another giant. That's not really the thing we're looking for, right? So that's the thing that we saw moving because he was standing upright. Uh, so yeah, let's head deeper into the cathedral. Oh, um... This thing is strong. Uh, but there it goes. Okay. Okay then. The ceiling in here is very dark though. Okay. A dual charm. And it looks like we're going to duel here. And there's another one, yeah. I heard him in the corner. There we go. Well, they looked a lot more scarier than they are. Uh, this is actually starting to look like the cleansing chapel, so I'm wondering if we're actually really close to a shortcut. Because judging from the messages, joy ahead, yeah, okay. That's actually really great. So let's go down, and I presume that leads us back to the cleansing chapel in some way. I don't like blood stains. Oh, for fuck's sake, where are we now? Oh, wait a second. Um, I was gonna say this looks familiar, but it actually doesn't. Oh, wait, this does. This is one of those doors, so it leads right outside then. Yeah, look at that. Uh, I am going to hit this bonfire. And quickly go to Firelink Shrine to spend my souls on a single level. So see you guys there. But yeah, I also found out that you see Firelink Shrine on the bottom there. At all times, actually, even so, uh, still no one back. So let's get Welcome home, with the Firekeeper and Welcome level up. Taken. We still don't know who killed Yol. I'm gonna suppose he's still dead. Uh, I want to go to 20 eventually with my intelligence, so uh, let's do that. Farewell, Ashen Thank you. Uh, let's quickly check on... Yol was probably still dead. Grerald hasn't returned from his pillaging. Yeah, he's dead. And maybe a quick look-see at Irina, because we needed to protect her. And if she dies, I'm gonna get the... That big guy on my ass. She looks fine. Oh, champion, do you wish to hear it? Okay. Have a pleasant pray. There we go. So let's head back to the cathedral and uh, see what we can do with that giant. Because that guy looks really interesting. Look at the drones, we have two of them filled and we should be coming really close to filling a third one with uh, St. Aldrich. Because he should be hiding in the cathedral somewhere. It's a cleansing chapel. And 
now that we have that uh, shortcut over there. It's kind of cool that you now look back on that wall where we, uh, on the bridge where we ended up. Kind of keeps everything in one cohesive uh, world. So let's get back up. And then we... Oh, wait a second. We came from over there, but we can go down. Fatty ahead. Yeah. Hello, Mr. Giant. Oh, shit. Yeah, well, that's a problem. What happens if you go down? Because I'm gonna suppose we then reach. Okay, goes to the right instead of to the left. Oh, let's be quiet. There she goes. Still sad. Still sad. So there's an item over here. Deep gem. That's an item we haven't found yet, is it? Infuse to create a deep weapon. A deep weapon. A gem of infused titanite found at the dregs of the Cathedral of the Deep. Used an infusion to create deep weapons. Deep weapons inflict a dark damage but lose scaling effect. There is a darkness that lies beyond human ken. Okay then, I'm not really sure what that all means, but... I guess we'll find out one way or another. So let's head back up with that giant. Oh! Oh, for fuck's sake, why didn't it drop down when we passed here first? Stop kicking it. God damn it. That was annoying. Where did that come from? And why didn't it drop down immediately? Oh, shit. So, uh, hi. Okay. He has quite a bit of range, actually. What is he doing? Can I actually fight this thing? Yeah, but not like that, probably. Oh, I can actually. Come on, big guy. God damn it. I did hit him. Down he goes. Get back. Okay, that makes things a bit more safe, I guess. Could have probably just killed him with my bow and arrow as well, but I do kind of like the magic. So that's one of those I'm gonna set myself on fire, dudes. Probably don't wanna. Oh, 
There we go. I want to antagonize him. I got Mother Estus. I really don't know how that works. So if uh, you guys know how that works, I get random charges of my Estus flask. And I don't really know how that works exactly. So I'm pretty free to run around here. No slimes on top of the wall. Okay. Nameless, nameless sword. Lloyd's sword ring. Interesting. And exploding bolts. So let's check out the ring. Boosts attacks when HP is full. Ring given to Knights of the Way of White depicts all Father Lloyd's sword of law. Much time has passed since the worship of Lloyd was common in the Way of White. The clerics of Karim had always strongly asserted that Lloyd was a derivative fraud and that the All Father title was self proclaimed. It's kind of the same description as another ring that we found before. I think the. Holy shit! The Shrine Handmaiden was uh, selling that. Okay, when are you going to attack? No, you don't. There we go. Okay, down he goes. Uh, so I have no way of getting up there right now, but I can go down. Let's don't forget to switch to my normal Asus flask. That I don't start chugging Ashen. Hello, Ashen Astus flasks for no reason. Um. Wait, no, it isn't. I was thinking about the fact that this might be the uh, the chapel down below, but it doesn't look like it. Although it might as well be. Oh! Holy sh... Don't fall off, don't fall off, there's another one. Where the hell are they coming from? Oh. Hello there! You know what? They really didn't like that fire sword, right? Oh yeah, look at that. Seek guidance. Uh, did I read that already? I don't think so. Miracle of stray souls displays more help from other worlds and reveals summon signs without using an ember. Fate serves as guidance as a guide for clerics, meaning they should have no need for secondhand wisdom. Be that as it may, this miracle has been passed down from soul to soul, providing a tiny ray of hope for the lost. So more messages will be displayed and summoning signs as well. That's actually interesting. So it helps to switch out for the fire sword once every while. So I can't go up here. There is a ladder over here. There was another way as well, but... I hear something banging and I'm wondering what that might be so this is pretty uh and backstab and down she goes yeah I'm getting pretty used to and I got on other why is that when enemies, some type of enemies die, I get another charge? It's really, really strange. Another ember. Which I might want to... Oh, now we're up top here. Okay, okay, okay. So is there anything else here? Probably not. No, that's just a wall, so that couldn't be. 
and maybe over here somewhere. Not this one. Not this one. Okay then. I'm gonna go back this way then. Uh, jump down. I see what lies ahead. And apparently that gave me some damage. Still no stairs. And I'm starting to think that since we saw that Aldrich is this type of sludge monster that the floor is actually Aldrich. Which is creepy in its own right. Uh, so that's where we went. Now down here. Okay. Here. That's a mimic, right? I don't see it breathing. Oh, but it is! Shit. There we go, so okay. Whew. I really hate mimics. Okay, now I'm not I'm not gonna even question it anymore. I'm getting charges for nothing. Uh, is it maybe the first time you slay an enemy? Because that kind of makes sense a bit. Um so that was very interesting. Um, deep Braille Divine Tome. A Braille Divine Tome of the Deep, belonging to the deacons of the cathedral. Give this to a storyteller to learn miracles of the deep, intended to teach divine protection to the deacons of the deep, but later dark tales were added to its pages, such that it is now considered a thing profane. So I'm actually wondering if I should give that to Irina. And that she won't die because of it. Okay, so that's we were up there a second ago. So let's look around here a bit. Maybe this is another high. Hi. Holy! Okay, fuck. Dropping off. And that's actually. I'm gonna use that as a tactic, though. Come on, drop down. He didn't fall for it. He didn't fall for it. I'm... Come on, drop down. I'm gonna beat your ass. In the back. Goodbye, Sir Knight. Well, judging from the fact that I didn't get a knight, and this guy isn't actually that all that special. What's kind of a dramatic entrance, though? Uh, any items over here? No. Not on the other side as well, because it's closed. So I can go the way he came. Be wary of tough enemy. Don't see anything yet, so I'm gonna first take this side route and see what's over here. Oh, what the hell just happened? That's one thing. That statue is doing weird stuff. No, you shall not. So 
So each of those does that. There we go. Um, you know what? Since I'm down here, uh, I might as well first check out this because I think this room is closed off. There doesn't seem to be another exit around here, so uh, what now? Is this an? Holy shit! What the fuck is that? Uh, I'm leaving. Holy shit! Get off! Holy... It kinda looks like that... Crocodile thing we fought in uh, Irritil of the Boreal Valley. Uh, that fog is... Not dissipating. I wanna use art from The Witcher. <laughs> To blast it away. Aldrich Sapphire. Uh, was that a ring then? Yeah. Recovers FP from critical attacks. A malformed ring left by Aldrich, Saint of the Deep. Recovers FP from critical attacks. Aldrich, infamous for his appetite for flesh, apparently had the desire to share with others the joy of imbibing the final shudders of life while luxuriating in his victims' screams. So as you might remember, we were told that Aldrich ate human sacrifices and that's why he became so bloated and turned into that black blob. This is an elevator, isn't it? Oh, it isn't. So that was just the lair of this spider? Okay then, I accept that I suppose. So let's head back out here. This guy's dead, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, just taking a quick look around. So I'm free to wander around here because the uh, the giant is dead. I take that back. There's another giant over there. Um. I'm gonna quickly switch to the fire sword. That made a lot of noise, actually. Hello, dude. I'm not doing nearly as much damage as I did to that other one. So I'm not gonna even bother. Um, let's switch back to the Uchi Katana and finish off the rest of those little critters. Because this one doesn't seem to be moving at all. And that sounds like another one of those knights. Whoa, 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 not on my head. So that's one of those knights followed by two of those little fuckers. We can go deeper. Oh, that was awesome. Midair Annihilation. What's this? Yeah, he doesn't want me to touch that. I do want to fight you in a bit more of an open space. There we go. There we go again. And then just finish them off, I presume. There we go. Okay. So backstabbing these guys. 
is actually pretty handy. An Ember and a Cathedral Knight Helm. So let's read that. Helmets and then over here. It looks pretty cool actually. It's a lot heavier of course. Massive Iron Helm worn by knights serving the Cathedral of the Deep. Repulsive creatures of the deep are sure to attract the foolish, but the Cathedral Knights are prepared to meet such intruders head-on with their more than ample might. Okay, then seems uh, pretty straightforward. Well, that's a weird creature to be on your wall. What is that? A, a cat monkey? I now pronounce you cat monkey. So, uh, there is a lever here, so why not pull it? Oh! Um... What does that even do? Oh, yeah, okay, forgot about those. Can I even destroy those things? By the color of it, I would say it's... Uh, corrosive. This is just... This doesn't even do anything. Okay. Large soul of an unknown traveler. Why do I have the feeling I'm gonna get face raped? Um, nothing's happening. I can kill those fellows. Wait, so this doesn't actually lead anywhere? Oh, God. There's only really one way. Well, except if I go the other way towards those uh, knights. Oh, uh, this is Aldrich, isn't it? What are those things sticking out of the sludge? Large Titanite Shard and Dunk Pie. Well, thank you. Soul of a nameless soldier. Oh, God. Oh, see, so these are the pieces what uh, the giant crashed through up there. Okay, then. Maidenhood. And everything else, maiden, but... White hood worn by traveling maidens, part of their formal attire regardless of rank. It is soft and well made, but ill-suited for use in battle. Sounds... Part of their formal attire, attire... Okay. Maiden gloves. And yeah, nothing really interesting. Okay, nothing's following me. Oh, so this must be the front gate then. Am I right? I kind of feel like I'm right. So let's open this then, I suppose. Or not, because I don't... Where the hell are we? Saint Biden. Okay. Uh, Homeward Bones. This just... Homeward Bones usually mean that you're at a dead end. Seriously? I just opened the, the back door or what? 
I can suppose it's a weapon that Saint Biden. Um, there we go. A silver Biden decorated by a holy symbol formerly wielded by Saint Klimt. He discarded his weapon that draws upon one's fate on the day that he put his own fate behind him. So yeah, um, a spear that's actually boosted by faith. Um, don't know what the big deal is about then. Because I needed to run, run through this sludge to even get there. And this is really annoying. I'm gonna get out eventually. Because right now I'm up to my knees in sludge. Okay, there we go. So past this one. Past this one. And there isn't one here. So we haven't been in here yet. Well, I kind of peeked in here, but... Another closed door. That we can... Open. Oh, now we're, now we're here. Okay. Kind of know where we are. We're up top to where that uh, leech monster is. And those were the gargoyles that we could see from down there. He's not going to reach up here, is he? Okay, so that's... Not, not going to listen. So I can go further down here. Oh, it's a knot here. <laughs> okay. Doors. A lot of doors. Is this that other shortcut? Okay. Now where does this lead? Oh, probably towards the crystal lizard if I remember correctly. Oh no. Oh! Okay. Um... Let's do this then. Ah, back to Firelink Shrine. I'm wondering if I need to kill the giant again. I would think the giants would be uh, too big to return from the dead, Welcome but... Home. Speak. Uh, lap lap. Then take nourishment. And put another one into intelligence. There we go. Farewell, Ashen One. Thank you, Firekeeper. And then we need to head to Irina. And I'm gonna risk it. I know it might be a bad idea to give that uh, profanity tone to her. But hey, maybe she won't even accept it. Oh, what's this? Champion of Ash, this divine tale yeah, is forbidden. Go. These are dark tales of things that lurk deep within men. These stories would not please you. Of course, if you insist, I will read them for you. Only... Oh, oh, they frighten me so. You know what? I'm not gonna do it the then. The little creatures that nibble at me in the darkness. Oh, um... But she did apparently take it from me. So let's see what that gives us. Deep protection. Miracle taught to inaugurate the deacons at the Cathedral of the Deep. Slightly boosts attack, damage absorption and resistance. While also increasing stamina recovery speed. The Deep was originally a peaceful and sacred place. But became the final rest for many abhorrent things. Things. Multiple. The Tale of the Deep offers protection for those who worship amidst those horrors. And then Gnaw, Dark Miracle taught in the Cathedral of the Deep, summons insect swarms, oh, that's that attack, to feast on foes. These insects which, which lurk in the deep have tiny jaws lined within, with fangs to tear open the skin and burrow into the flesh in the blink of an eye, causing intense bleeding. That sounds terrible. Uh, she doesn't really sell anything else. You know, in my heart, I okay, never mind. Terribly. Nothing new. Have a pleasant journey. I pray for your safety. I pray for yours as well, because I don't want you to die because I gave you that creepy tomb. 
Tome. Tome. It's Tome. Um. I don't think I can boost uh, any weapons. Reinforce. Probably not. I need large tar titanite. Yeah, for everything. Maybe for the bow? Yeah, you know, why not? Probably gonna find a lot more titanite shards <laughs> after this, so. Uh, Rare Out still hasn't returned, okay then. So, um, before we head back to the Cathedral of the Deep, I'm gonna take a little break. So, thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And if you haven't already, don't uh, forget to give the thoughts to subscribe to my channel, because I really, really appreciate the support. So, thank you guys again enormously for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video or stream. Goodbye!